everyone, Mike Mixon from KeyboardAmerica.com here in Lewis Beach, Delaware. Welcome to this week's Geno's Tyro Song of the Week and Buttons class. This one's another classic on a clear day. And this is in bundle one, of course, bundle one and two, and bundle one, two, three. Now, you should have gotten an email from me with the latest firmware update, so uh, I'm actually going to show you how to do that real quick in this video uh, so there's no confusion. Very, very, very easy to do. Now, we're going to take a look at the settings and the music for On a Clear Day, so let's get started. Okay, so we're going to be going to Orchestra Big Band 2 style for this, Tempo 106, and I'm going to show you in the video, we're going to be playing around with this upper octave, minus one, and you're going to learn an interesting tip uh, with using that, which is uh, a lot of fun. Of course, we're going to be using Intro 2, Variation B and B, and of course, remember, um, if you're in my book bundle club, the red notes get held down going to the next chord. And this is going to make you learn how to play chords like a pro with my custom chords on there. Now, the other thing that's important with my custom chords is I'm using the right inversions to teach you how to play chords easily and real, real fun and uh, your fingers are in the right position and every song is different uh, in which inversion we play so putting the notes and the fingering on the music here is very very vital to you learning let's take a look now at the settings for on a clear day okay so here's your upper octave here and we're going to hit the minus one so that we can uh, bring the octave down on the keyboard. And it's pretty interesting. I'll show you something real quick. I'll go to OTS uh, 3 here. Um, you can see I have a clarinet on. Now, different clarinets have different octaves. So um, you have to use a specific clarinet that uh, has an octave up built into it. And this uh, clarinet does. And that, of course, makes it nice so that when I put the grand on, it's an octave down, but that clarinet will be at the normal octave. So you kind of have to listen to the sounds uh, in your genos. Now, on, uh, we're using OTS 2, 3, and 4, and we're only using variation B and D. So on this one, you're going to reach up and just change the one-touch setting in the middle of the song. And uh, that'll be uh, a little bit challenging, but a lot of fun. And of course, I'll email you my custom style uh, on a clear day, so you can just load that into your Genos and ha don't have to do these settings. Now we're using Intro 2, we're starting out with Variation B. I've got an Ambient Grand and a Vibraphone on OTS 2, and it's 100 on the ambient grand and 127 on the vibraphone. And that really gives you a beautiful sound there. That octave down on the ambient grand's nice. Now, on OTS3, I'm using a clarinet and a soft trumpet. And they're both going to be volume 127. And you can hear... It's fine now, even though my octave is one octave down. And on OTS-4, I've got big band brass SW, sweet tenor sax, and big band alto sax. And the first two are at 110, and the big band alto sax is at 100. Now, you can notice I also have the harmony arpeggiator button on here. So I'll hit direct access and harmony, and you can see that's on standard duet, and that is set on auto. So you don't have to worry about choosing uh, right one, right two, any of those things on there. And when you go to three, I have harmony arpeggiator on, and that's just a standard duet one. 
So on four, we have standard duet two. On three, we have standard duet one. It does make a little bit of difference there. Okay, so here we go with On a Clear Day. show you something that I did in there to make it interesting. You can do it at the beginning of the song too. I'm on nine here. You see where the fingers are for on a clear day, right? Well, the chords are actually perfect to do something like this in the beginning. Watch. take those notes because the chords in the intro are really perfect to do your own little thing there. So play around with it a little bit, have a little bit of fun, and uh, we'll get on now with the uh, rest of the video. So okay, so we have this upper transposed down here, and uh, I wanted to show you something pretty interesting on here. On number two, for instance, all of your OTSs are going to be minus one in the octave shift. 
So when you're going to go for different sounds, and what I'm going to do here is touch my right two. You see I have a vibraphone on there, but let's change this to a woodwind real quick, and I'll show you what I'm talking about. The romance clarinet, you can hear how low that clarinet is. But if you go to orchestra clarinet, you can hear it's up an octave. So it's pretty interesting. You can use that uh, minus one and find other sounds in there that are automatically up another octave. And that really gives you that beautiful uh, piano, low piano. There, which is really nice. Okay, last but not least, I want to show you this. I sent you all out an email with the latest Genos update. And with your unit off over here, you want to press start, stop, and style after you've loaded the thumb drive with the Genos update and then power it on while holding these two buttons. So you might need a third person or a second person to get over here and turn it on for you. But that'll do the update and then you just follow the instructions on the uh, screen. It tells you to hit start stop uh, again uh, after it's on so that it starts the process. It only takes a few minutes and it's very easy to do. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed On a Clear Day, uh, and that's Book Bundle 1, Book Bundle 1 and 2, Book Bundle 1 and 3. You'll all be getting that out there. Next week will be a Book Bundle 2 song for all you guys who have Book Bundle 2. Keep in mind we have Genos is in stock and we've got some new interesting items that we have uh, for the Genos. We'll be... Um, putting that on our site pretty soon in our bundle. And remember, you get all three bundles, one, two, and three. So you get all these great lessons that we've done in the past and in the future. It's all included in your huge uh, bundle that we offer on the Genos. And just email me at uh, genosmike at hotmail.com if you want a free chord chart. And I am working on a new chord chart that I'll be putting out pretty soon. And I'll just be emailing that to everyone on the list. Okay, until next time, this is Mike Mixon from KeyboardAmerica.com saying have a great day, keep playing, and see you soon.